um, for the launch of LA Fashion Week, but this event is is benefiting City of Hope Hospital, which is a hospital that I've been involved with um, because they do great research, but they also do great treatment. And my brother died of leukemia, so uh, it's you know I try to work with hospitals that that do research and, and, and care of cancer patients. Primarily, if you have, for me, it's like if I have a direct connection to it. And again, like I said, my brother had cancer, so cancer is something that I'm close to. I've done stuff for AIDS because I've lost friends to AIDS. I'm a woman, so I'm concerned about breast cancer. I mean, it's easy to show up when you have a personal reason to be there. You know, I, I really think LA, this is like, this is the moment for LA fashion. And um, you can see, I mean, each year it gets a little more glitzy and glam and, and bigger faces. So I think it's, it's fun. And I love LA designers. I mean, I live in LA now, so I think they really reflect the lifestyle out here. But they also are making an impact on the international scene. I don't know if, if we're looking to change the look of LA fashion. I think it's just to, to highlight the look of LA fashion. LA fashion is, is thriving. Um, I mean, I said earlier in another interview, it's like everyone in the world got Ugg boots. And I mean, that, that trend, I mean, not that they were, obviously they're Australian originally, but what made them fashionable was how people wore them in LA. And I think, you know, I think denim is that way. I think that whole, you know, juicy and joie and so many LA designers have had a huge impact on, on how people dress, so. Thank you.